Okay, so I walked about two hours and I'm extremely exhausted. Cool. And all those little pools where the people are are natural hot springs. So I made it finally. And There are probably over a half a dozen pools with different different temperatures. Even the dog likes the natural hot springs. <laughs> Okay, so that was absolutely relaxing. Um, it was so worth the, I think it took me about two and a half hours to hike um, to the spot and Now I gotta do my two, hopefully two hour hike back. I don't want to take as, oops, as long as it took me to get here. But those um, natural hot springs were over a hundred degrees um, and it was amazing. I had a really good time hanging out with some people, talking to a couple people um and it's just it, it's a great day um so i'm glad hope, hopefully you enjoy the sorry i have to pay attention or i will fall the edge is like right there um but if you do decide to come it is well well worth the hike just be prepared because it is a good strenuous hike. I don't, can't remember what they're called, but they're these little um, like cleats that you put um, on your hiking boots to help with grip because there were some patches along the trail that were snowed over. One last thing, if nothing, if the hot springs don't draw you, the natural hot springs don't draw you to this place, the hike and the scenery should. I mean, it's gorgeous. This is the trail I've been taking. It's absolutely gorgeous. So, I have to say <clears throat> that I'm super lucky to be able to push myself 